we lose our principles, we invite chaos. Bobby Cannavale just brings a lot of humor that I think the show really needs. But as much as Irving puts on the funny face and he's got the funny look, there's something brewing underneath. He's like a powder keg, and that last scene is the powder keg going off. Look at the sky. Take a deep breath. Try to enjoy the fresh air. That scene is proof positive why he is a Dark Army operative. We're retiring this shit state, and you're taking his place. You work for the Dark Army now. We love to take characters and flip-flop their situation. So Dom is this loyal FBI agent. And so to take that and corrupt that in a blatant fashion by literally axing someone to death right in front of her, it took an extreme like that to convincingly put her in that position of being a mole. Each character in this show struggles with what their moral compass is, and I think that's what makes them so dynamic. Am I to blame for this? Not telling her how much I miss Mr. Robot. It certainly brings into play the question, what is right and wrong? I mean, that there really is a lot of gray area, and we don't necessarily know if something is all good or all bad. I'm the problem. This was my fault. The quagmire that Elliot's facing now in this third season really goes into a lot of gray area. I did this. Now that he hasn't actually saved anything, but he's actually made it worse, what does that mean? Do good intentions matter at all? And I think that goes for all the characters. They're constantly being pushed against their boundaries of what they think is right and wrong. You can lie to yourself all you want, but when you're alone at night, the shit will haunt you. Angela does some pretty devastating things this season. She's questioning herself, and it's gotten to a point where she doesn't know right from wrong, and she doesn't know whether or not she did the right thing. Are you still going to evacuate the recovery center? That's been done already. So this is really happening. To address the consequences of your actions is where the rubber meets the road when it comes to what is right and wrong. I think that it takes us into interesting places, especially when you have to deal with remorse and guilt over what you did. How does that change you? And if it doesn't, how does that reinforce who you are?